It would be a sin to have Holland hanging out on your show and not play her song. That's everything and more on Boost 1019 with J-Bo and Yoshi. If you went to the Boost birthday party a couple years back, you probably saw Torn Wells, Kristen Gray, and Holland. Yes, that was super fun. I always remember that whenever we come to St. Louis. You guys are probably my favorite. Oh, thank you. We appreciate it. So in regards to your music, is mainstream something that you are interested in? And if so, has it been easier or harder than you expected? So this is my perspective on this whole thing. I'm not going to create art just to fit a certain genre or to create a certain audience. I'm just going to be Holland and go play some club shows and put out this music that's on my heart. And whoever that attracts and whatever that attracts, I am cool with. You don't want to be put in a box. Right. At the end of the day, to answer your question, I just want to be, I want to be your friend. I don't want to be some untainable, like, famous person or, like, striving after this platform or something. Right. I want to actually, like, get on your level and speak to you. Because how else are people going to feel any comfort or peace or relatability in trying to strive and grab after something? You have to get on people's level, and by doing that, that means being vulnerable. So that's what I'm going to do. Oh, yeah. And, you know, some people, and sometimes whether it's a song or someone's career, some people are meant for the church. Some people are meant to dabble in it. And some people are also meant to go out. God came to heal the sick, not just the healthy. Right. There are couples who want to have a God-honoring relationship, especially when it comes to intimacy. Holland will tell you how she navigated that. This is Boost 1019.